Hi, I'm Paul Gorenson. I'm out here at Rosita Plants. As you know, we just announced that we turned on uh, operations and started injecting oxygen and started producing uranium. So right now, we're out here at the remote ion exchange plants uh, where we actually have the, uh, the, the well field produces uranium, the uranium bearing water into the plant that comes into those ion exchange columns you see right over there. Each one of those ion exchanges, three of them, are loaded up with, with resin. We run two at a time. One loads up with resin, the other one catches any uranium that comes off of the resin. And as they load up, we can switch columns and then take the loaded resin offline. From there, we transfer it into this trailer right here. And from that trailer, we'll, we'll load that resin into it and we'll haul it to, up to the central processing plant about a mile away. And from there, that'll be offloaded and uh, the uranium will be removed from resin and the fresh resin will be brought back in. But in reality, we never actually have an empty column. Constantly bring out fresh resin, or take out loaded, bring back fresh. That's why you see these compartments are in that trailer. So we can always have rotation of the kind of exchange resin. One of the things I want you to see is that this is the key part of the process where we're actually capturing the uranium in the solution. And if you listen outside of the welding machines, you can hear in the background, because as you know, we just recently got done with construction. Have a little few things that are going on in the background, maintenance and all that stuff. But this is really quiet. All you hear is just the low hum of the motors. That's that's the extent of the noise and the activity here. Since we're moving water, we're not. There's not a lot of equipment moving around. It's moving a, a material. And to get a better view of that, we're going to go out to the well field. Where I'll, we'll show you what's going on out there, and you may actually be kind of bored when you're out there. So thank you.